A jury has been deliberating all afternoon in the case of a deadly shooting at a Minnesota health clinic. 68-year-old Gregory Ulrich was charged with murder, attempted murder, and setting off explosives. The clinic shooting spree took place in Buffalo last year. Our Mariel Mose is in the courtroom today as Ulrich took the stand in his own defense. She's outside of the Wright County Courthouse in Buffalo. L. Frank, the, the jury is still deliberating behind me in the Wright County Courthouse, and they've been deliberating since 1.30 this afternoon. They're trying to decide verdicts on 11 counts, the most serious one being first-degree murder. And if Gregory Ulrich was premeditated and intentional in killing 37-year-old nurse Lindsay Overbay. On the stand, Ulrich told the jury he was cut off from pain medication after two months from a 2016 surgery. He described extreme lengths he went through to get a refill, including sending his medical records and a personal note to Senator Amy Klobuchar and former President Donald Trump. When those calls went unanswered, he decided to attack the clinic to draw attention. He told the jury, quote, I wanted to sensationalize things and get a louder message. I wanted to get in the papers and get people's attention so people understand what pain is like without pain medication. Ulrich brought four pipe bombs and a handgun to the Alina Crossroads Clinic on February 9th, 2021. He argues that he just wanted to cause property damage. While the detonated bombs did just that, he also shot at five employees, killing one of them, 37-year-old mother of two, Lindsay Overbay. Ulrich told the jury that he did not intend to kill anyone, just inflict pain like he was experiencing himself. In court, a recording was shared of the 911 call Ulrich made inside the clinic after he was done shooting. He told the operator he was the shooter and asked them to tell police to back off so he could surrender. The state argued that telling police to back off delayed care to the victims, which supports their argument for his intent to kill. And Ulrich admitted in court Thursday that of the five women he shot, none of them directly treated him or gave him care at any point. We also are hearing that deliberations are going to continue through the night with no exact cutoff time. Usually that means, though, that uh, the jury is close to coming up with a verdict. Okay, we'll keep updating things. Thank you, Elle.